Santa Cruz de la Palma offers everything that you'd expect from a city in the Canary Islands. Manors with carved balconies, colonial-style churches and plazas, restaurants, shops, museums, all tastefully and delicately restored, yet adapted to present-day demands on buildings. The city was founded in 1493 by Governor Alonso Fernandez de Lugo. It became an important port between the old continent and the Americas. From the very start of its existence, it faced countless invasions by pirates and was gradually fortified properly. In the 16th century, it even became the third largest port in Europe. The first ever customs office for American affairs was also headquartered here. Anyone that wanted to do business with the New World had to register right here and pay a customs fee. Plaza España is considered to be the most interesting example of Canary Islands architecture out of all of the islands. Santa Cruz de la Palma shows no signs whatsoever of any hurry or haste. It gives a feeling of complete stillness and serenity. The main boulevard is almost a kilometer long, and you'll find the Naval Museum at its end. At one time, the best ships in the world were made here. Thanks to the resinous wood of the local pine trees, they had superb qualities and a long lifespan. The museum is located naturally.